from the IHTN studios, it's Braves Beat. What's up, Braves? Welcome to this week's episode of Braves Beat. I'm Sailor Betts. And I'm Jack Hammond. Happy Friday, Braves. We are officially two weeks out from spring break. And a happy last day of third quarter, everyone. Speaking of which, seniors, your community service hours are due today. If you do not have them turned in today, you will not be able to participate in senior project. Get them in. We've got a lot of news to cover, so let's get started. Last weekend, the juniors and seniors had a blast in the Wild West at the Odd Couples Dance. The upperclassmen and their parents boot scooted and boogied to songs ranging from Bohemian Rhapsody to Gas Pedal. Thank you to everyone who came out to help support After Prom. Our Indian Hill Mock Trial Team Black is currently in Columbus competing at the state competition. Our Braves dominated in the district and regional competitions and are hoping to take home Indian Hill's sixth state championship title. Good luck, Braves, and Kurahi! Now let's toss it over to Jay Ball with some humor. All right, guys, so today I'm here with my stand-up comedy jokes. Um, uh, so I unplugged all of my devices, but where did the electricity go? Do you guys get the joke? Uh, my second joke of the day is uh, National uh, Day. <laughs> um, I walked uh, American Discovery tra tra Trail from east to west, but I couldn't find uh, Brussels sprouts. Why do I eat Brussels sprouts? Thank you for my stand-up comedy. In honor of Women's History Month, Indian Ho High School is teaming up with Girl Up. Girl Up is a United Nations Foundation by Girls for Girls campaign that fundraises and advocates for gender equality worldwide. By focusing on adolescent girls, Girl Up strives to empower girls around the world by focusing on proper education, safety, health, and leadership. This year, all proceeds donated to Girl Up will go towards supporting access to a proper education for girls in India, as well as offering nutritional and reproductive health education through peer education and mentorship programs. This past weekend, Ben Bayliss, Ashley Prue, McKenna Hack, Peyton Hoffman, Lisa Klassner, Megan O'Brien, and Ellie and Anna Potagil headed upstate to compete in the Indoor Track and Field State Championships. New school records from Ashley in the 1600 meter and Anna in the 200 and 400 meter. Huge congrats to the 4x400 relay team, Ellie, Megan, Louisa, and Anna, who became state champions with a new school record of 4 minutes, 9.39 seconds. This past week was the first annual wing mile. Let's check it out. Well, here we're organizing the wing mile. Colton and Sumner and Drew are going to have to eat approximately 15 wings. Uh, while running an entire mile. The last lap, they have to eat at least two blazing wings. Uh, it's gonna be probably the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. How are you feeling right now? I'm feeling ready, I'm feeling prepared. I don't feel like anybody else has a chance, really. I feel good, I feel like I'm underestimated, but uh, I don't think Drew has the mental fortitude to carry through four whole laps, you know? Colton, how are you feeling right now? Uh, I'm pretty cold, but these wings, Hopefully it will heat me up a little bit. <laughs> Shout out to Harvard, <laughs> where I'll be playing basketball in the fall. Thank you. Three, two, one. What is going on in the minds of our competitors right now? The thought process as they smash these wings. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a tough competition. Oh, oh he's up! He's oh, going! Regretting the decision to go fast? Absolutely not. This is what Harvard wants. I think mentally, not yakking right now. It's all I gotta do to win this. Oh, this oh is God, it. Can he keep it down or will I be too much? Owie, owie, owie. Owie, ow, oof, ow. Ow, ow. He's a champion. Undisputed champion. Ah! Congrats to Drew Plummer for winning. Way to go, man. 
The, the IH boys lacrosse team had their first scrimmages of the season this past Friday at Tomahawk Stadium, where they swept the CHL and took the dub against every team they played, including Marymount and Wyoming. Their future looks bright, and you will not want to miss their upcoming games this season. Go Braves! Our small but mighty legend staff is in need of some help. They are looking for any good images you might have from the first semester of the school year. They can be phone images or camera images. Specifically, we need fall sports, the ice storm snow day, fall homecoming, spirit week, dress up days, Braves marching band competitions, cabaret, and anything else that you would like to have considered for the yearbook. You could become legendary. Check your phones and send any possibilities to Ms. Piper at julie.piper at ihsd.us as soon as possible. Congratulations to John Mark Williams, who took second place this past Saturday at the OHSAA Wrestling District Finals. Yesterday, he headed off to the state championship. Best of luck. Way to be a brave. Mark your calendars on March 20th for a celebration of Holi, the Indian Festival of Colors. See Alina Goble or Monty Singh if you have any questions. Now time for a commercial break specifically for those who may have lost their motivation towards the end of the quarter. If you or a loved one have been diagnosed with senioritis, you may be entitled to GPA compensation. Senioritis is a contagious disease that spreads through any form of contact with a carrier. Symptoms include having difficulty meeting deadlines, completing assignments, and studying. You do not have to be a senior to experience these effects. They can appear as early as freshman year and as late as fourth quarter senior year. Please do not wait to take action. This disease can cause extremely low GPAs. To learn more, call 1-800. I'll do it later. Well, that's all we have for this week, Braves. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. And as always, stay, stay classy, classy, Indian Hill. Hill. Welcome to the secret stairwell. It's locked. It's obviously not locked. It's called the data room. And there's another data. It just reminds me how scary hell is. It says they're left by the senior stud gov. Then how come I never got one?